Okay, so this is day one. Your name is Lucy Evans, and you are, I'm 18 years old, and I'm going away to, to school at the end of the summer. And well, here's to not forgetting. Love to bike and stay active. Whatever you do, don't let yourself sit in front of a TV all day. So this bridge is your favorite part of the path. And back there is where you saw the crane that one What time. do we have here? What are you doing? Give that back! Look, I was just trying to have some fun. And this, Lucy, is what a prick looks like. So what were you doing anyway? Here's a dollar. If I give it to you, will you go away? I'm just curious. Here, let me help you. Who's Lucy? I am. Now go away! So this whole thing is just some vanity project? So I'm vain, and you're a jerk. Nice knowing ya. Look, I'm sorry, that's not what I meant to say. Do you want help? Yeah, that's a brilliant idea. Why not? Look, I don't know what you were doing, but how often do you get the opportunity to help out a complete stranger? I, haven't you ever done anything crazy Here, before? I've still got that dollar. Now, if you run that way, I can throw it to Jeez, you. fine! I get it. Wait, give me your wallet. Okay, Benjamin. Now I've got a month before I've got to finish this project. Now if you will stop mocking me, I could use the help. In the meantime, I'll hold on to this. Okay. They say it's a really hard program to get into. Dad says he's gonna come visit you. Mom, what are you doing? You have to rest your leg. Miss Angeline, it's time for lunch. Are you coming? right. You should get home now. You have a lot of packing to do. Oh my gosh! It's so cute! <gasps> there they go. first step. Why didn't you say anything? Now to start all over again. Try not to scare her. She doesn't take well to strangers. And don't stick that thing in her face. And try not to act awkward. And it's okay. Okay. Where is she? She must still be down at dinner. We can wait here.
Is that you? Yeah. I've never seen those before. This is the bottom half of my father. <laughs> Can I help you with something? Hi, Mom. Mom, this is Ben, a friend of mine. Lucy! They didn't tell me you'd be coming in. How are things? Mom. Can open them. So pretty. Oh, your flight, okay? Yeah. Of course. Right. Okay, get. Daddy will do it for the first plane, okay? All right. Are the pedals too? Is it the seat too high? Oh, no. I. It's too tough. I can't drive. Talk to your mom. For your flight. Ah, shit. No, no, no! Come on. Uh, I'm sorry. Not you. It's okay. We we can fix it. Look at it. You can't fix this. It's it's gone. Lucy. I used to take a lot of pictures back then. I, I wanted to be a photographer. But her father was gone uh, quite a lot of the time. Mrs. Evans, if you could tell Lucy anything. I'm, I, I, I don't, um, I'm feeling very tired. I'm sorry. Do I know you? Oh, it, it's okay. Um, oh, you are very nice. You should meet my daughter, Lucy. <laughs> I remember when she was nine years old and she was making her first communion. All the girls wore white dresses with white shoes, but not my Lucy. Lucy wore a white dress with black shoes, so I would know which one she was as she walked up the aisle. We're recording. Mom, I want to leave you with something that you told me. Fear can haunt us until the day we die. It can take over our days and our nights. It can destroy friendships and relationships and even stop us from enjoying life. If we let it. Here's to not forgetting.